Open myself up. For what? I'm going on a big mission with the boys. Bobby, I'm going on a big mission with the boys. What should I have for my breakfast? I'm really hungry, but I'm in the mood for a smoothie, but I don't feel like that's gonna satisfy me. I'll put some granola on top. Perfect. <laughs> Just eating my smoothie bowl. Watch my what I eat in a week to find out how to make my smoothie bowl. So good. Later I'm doing come dine with my, with my family. I haven't even decided what I'm doing. So I have all my food list ready. I might make espresso martinis, we'll see. I'm making it like this really complicated cake that I really shouldn't make because I'm so bad at making cakes, but I'm gonna do it and it's gonna fail, whatever. I'm gonna make the Gigi Hadid pasta and then I'll make bruschetta as well. And I think it's a pretty good list. I think I'm pretty talented. So me and my get ready with me's, every single video has to get ready with me. So I have to go online with college. Lots of online college vlogs. I'm so pasty. It's my one flaw. <laughs> my one flaw in this world is how pasty I am. But we all have to have flaws. Why are you talking to yourself? I'm just talking about how I'm flawless except for the fact I'm really pasty. How does it feel to be a pasty boy and not have access to like fake tan or anything? I think I look weird with fake tan now. Don't knock it till you try it. People were voting on my poll saying I should dye my hair blonde again. Like what? My hair can't handle that. Just dye it brown. It's blonde. It is brown. Blonde. It's literally not blonde. It's blonde. But I'm Lisa Simpson. <laughs> it's not Insert picture of Lisa Simpson. Everyone knows what you Lisa Simpson is. You stop doing that like in your editing, doing pictures. Not pictures, you know, like because I putting can't. in a meme or a sound effect. It's because you're lazy. Yeah, it is because I'm posting so much. I'll start editing like more funnier things in, but the thing is, is that your average person doesn't really notice that. So I'm not going to waste my time on shit no one really notices. It's actually so funny, some like the amount of random true fans. Like there was one guy who was like, he was just saying something about the, I was talking about like plus size models on my story. Just starting a conversation with the people and he was like giving me a big long opinion so I was praying to him and then he was like anyway he'd been following me since whatever mm. 2017 and I was like that is so weird Sophie and Sophie was like a cult or something but now I'm boxing my North Face jacket that I never wear why you just got that and it was great I got it like two months ago but I, I got a um, profit off of it like I just don't wear it that much so why should I keep something that I wear? I told my friend I'd collect her in 10 minutes but I need a post office first so probably not guys I've never had the most perfect position for my camera I'm trying to eat less protein bars because like it just terrifies me what's in them like what the fuck is in a protein bar like literally tell me horse poo oh little skies I went to your little skies phase and just there I was like I'm gonna listen to little skies again because I haven't listened to him in like two years but I was like I know all of the words to one of his albums and I haven't listened like two years because I just listened to his album like on repeat. It was actually kind of creepy. I was like to my friend, let's go early. Let's go like 1.30, currently 2.30. <laughs> I'm so bad at timing, especially cause I'm the one driving. So I'm like, they can wait for me. I used to never put in me speaking in my videos, like unless it was like funny. But I don't know why I thought some of it would be like funny. Oh my God, those girls are so fast. Whoa. Like they had a really nice color combo going on and they were all wearing hijabs. It was like a brown puffer, they were, wow. They really were rocking the style. I shouldn't be allowed on TikTok Live. It's not safe for like anyone's well-being. I was on TikTok Live and I was genuinely saying stuff I should not have been saying. <laughs> I dress like a homeless person, like massive hoodies. Don't show off my body. It's also winter and I'm just like, I work so hard for my bodies and like exercise all the time eat really healthy and then i'm just like eh, i'm gonna i'm gonna wear a hoodie oh i'm so happy i'm not in school have i actually told you guys that i'm the happiest person since leaving school i just feel like i'm my most me right now success is following me in like a slow process like i'm seeing results of all the work i've put in over the years and i'm so happy moral of the story never go up. we have matching hats on that's really adorable <laughs> it's both <Baltic> again <laughs> Birds are so cute. I beach. One night beach. Look at that. So I don't know why I came up with the idea that. Me, sorry, you're just gonna have to deal with this like a big. <laughs> I don't know why I came up with the idea that me and my family should do come down with me. It's half five. I still have to get loads of things in the shop. I just went to the shop, and then realized I didn't have ID with me, and I literally have to get like alcohol and shit. Yeah, I got like half the things in one shop. Now I'm gonna go to another shop, and I couldn't find basil. So. There's no way I'm making Italian food out of basil. Now off to Tesco. Blur out the part where I say where my where I live. Let's begin. The oven is on. I'm gonna make my cake first. Sean is watching TV. That's really rude of him. Why am I making hazelnut cake? It said the word Italian, so I figured it's Italian. <laughs> 
it makes sense. I have a headache. Goodbye. So my cake is a cooking. What yeah. time's it? Midnight. You're actually fucking gas. Take a shot of vodka. It's gross. You do it. No, you do it. No, you do it. No, you do it. You do it first. I said it first. Okay. Sean, do you want to take a shot of vodka with us? Uh, <laughs> this just gives me trauma. I don't know when the last time I took a shot of vodka. This is gross. Clink, clink, bitch. It burns. I feel it in my heart. <laughs> so, to make the Gigi had egg pasta, very hard balancing three courses at a time, and my cake didn't rise at all. I don't know how to make cakes and I've never ever been able to. I, it's a personal problem. Every time they don't rise, I don't know why. So I didn't add baking powder to my cake because I'm inept at cooking. And this pasta doesn't look right, I'm not gonna lie. It doesn't look like how it looked when Gigi Hadid did. Wow. Water please. <laughs> what am I, your slave? So you need to have recovery and fit. <laughs> but they break their... <gasps> we have reformed alcoholic parents. We can't mention alcohol around them. We have new cutlery, please. <laughs> They're just doing dry January. That, that is delicious, Sophie. Do you think? Mm. It's by Gigi Hadid, so. I wonder how many cows. I don't even think about that mm. one. At the end, we'll do our scores. And we also have a fun game. And dessert is going to be a bit of a mix of a few things. And those hazen look like? Uh, I forgot to put baking powder in it. Now, Gigi Hadid is very skinny. I'm not sure how she's eating this. It's actually yeah. good doing Gigi Hadid's a model. Does she's Gigi, actually lying. Does Gigi Hadid eat this all the time? Why are you sitting there looking at yourself, Sophie? That's very rude. I'm not yeah. doing a video. You're sitting there looking in your camera. Yeah, I'm pouting your lips. I was actually looking at him because I can see him in the camera. Who? Him. Yeah, yeah. me. Oh, shit. <laughs> you're not in the camera. The camera face. <laughs> that made me really sad. I want to be in Italy with bread. Yeah. You just want to be in Italy with bread. Yeah. A lot of people want to be in Italy with the Italian men or the fabulous. No. I want to be there with my friends. So no, just sit me down at a restaurant, a little table on my own with a plate of bread. <laughs> Doesn't that sound like a dream? Oh. So, for the entertainment, <laughs> I sell this. <laughs> I hid a potato somewhere downstairs and you have to go find it quick. Go! What's the winner, guys? Go! What's you have to go find it! Oh, you have to go find it! Oh, no. No. <laughs> Shut up, no you didn't. Come on, put that back. You're fucking gas. <laughs> I bet you there's no potatoes she's having those on. <laughs> this is not, it's so fun! This is yes, it is! Luke. <laughs> it was in there! Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you get a shot of vodka. Just, because I can't use two shots. Do it. Wait, fine. fine. <laughs> okay, great. The ratings on my flat biscuit cake are quite well. Exceeding expectation. Mm. What tattoo should I get for 100,000 subscribers? I'm gonna set one now and be like, if I ever get 100,000 subscribers, this is the tattoo I'm getting. I'm making like a mad one. No. It's not funny. <laughs> you can't say stuff like that on the internet. Why not? I'll blur it out for your own safety. I'm saying that because you're probably never gonna get 100,000 subscribers, so it's okay to say that. Say you're rating out of 10 and just, you know, and while I have a little talk. Yeah, and then tell me. Oh, okay, well, I didn't know how harsh to be. Okay, you have to go away then, you're not gonna listen. The starter bruschetta is pretty nice. Pasta. Very nice, bit dense, bit heavy. And then the cake, also nice, a little bit dense and a bit heavy. I think overall the food was pretty solid. It wasn't very adventurous, you know? No vegetables, I love vegetables. I'd ask for water a few times. Water, please. Espresso martinis out of a can. Me and Sean were the only ones to dress up and dressed up after a while. So if you didn't dress up, the entertainment was, we had to find a potato. That's not really entertaining. And um, the music, Paolo Antini, he's Scottish, he's not even Italian. I'm going to give it. Uh, so the starters, uh, let me think. The starters were pretty good. Bruschetta, um, I like bread but olive oil and salsa, that was excellent. The mains didn't look great, but they were, that was pretty good. Pasta a la vodka, mm, what's not to like about that? And the dessert, it was really good as well, with double cream. And again, double cream, what's not to like about that? So all the food was excellent. The uh, presentation left a little bit to be desired and the waitressing skills were a little bit lacking, you know? Like the enthusiasm was there. Dry January doesn't help. The entertainment was a bit... Uh, 
bit basic, but you know, it got us going at the same time, find a potato, so. Sophie's dinner was uh, very nice, very entertaining. The starter was very good, actually. The, um, yeah, I enjoyed the starter. I ate all the starter. The, um, the main course was very tasty, a little heavy maybe. And uh, the garlic bread was, you know, quite, quite good. Dessert was lovely. Um, the hazelnut cake was a big hit. Very full after it, quite full. I, fe I felt there could have been a little bit more fruit and vegetables. Some cocktails for the non-alcoholic drinkers in the in the house would have been nice. We did have an affogato at the end, but um, unfortunately I got the one that first once was a little bit too much coffee in it. Anyway, overall, the entertainment now was mm, hiding a potato. That's, I draw the line at that. I thought she could have put a bit more effort into that. So I will give her a... I'm gonna give it 7.5. My score is seven out of 10. An eight. Bye. I don't know how Gigi Hadid is a skinny legend. Yeah. Do we look, do like, we look like Gigi Hadid now? Yeah, I look like Gigi Hadid now. Gigi Hadid <laughs> Honestly, Oshin does look like Gigi Hadid, so. <laughs> when you have the same physique as Gigi Hadid. <laughs>